are back from intermission in what's shaping up to be a crazy night here in Chicago. We have a special challenge tag team match in the ring. You see TJ Dalton and Davey Andrews on the same team here. They were supposed to be in the opening match tonight against each other. Davey Andrews, the top graduate out of the ROH wrestling school. He's out of the first class of the wrestling school. And this is only a second ever match. The Carnage crew in rare form tonight, attacking both men because they had a point to make. As a result, we have this special challenge match. And look at Andrews and Dalton, they are not intimidated. Well, they're certainly taking the fight right to the Carnage crew. The Carnage crew gets double drop kicked. Andrew, Andrews and Dalton going after Vito. Andrews and Dalton, double back drop. Andrews and Dalton trying to score the quick upset before the Carnage crew can get unloaded. Well, you know, they gotta be a little bit angry at the fact that their match was ruined. Carnage crew trying to make examples out of them, trying to send messages to Foley, Moff, and Whitmer through them by giving them that beating earlier tonight. And now it looks like they're on the receiving end of the beating. I can't believe it. Luke and DeVito getting dominated. Well, it's a horrible mistake to try to get up on the rope and mount the ropes. Davey Andrews in just a second match just learned that lesson, and TJ Dalton is about to doomsday device from the Carnage crew. Well, I think it's only fitting we see the doomsday device and we saw the flapjack earlier. Shades of the Midnight Express. I can't believe Logan DeVito trying to jump Mick Foley, getting into it with Moffat Whitmer, ruining that pure wrestling match, and boy, did that ever make Steamboat lose his cool, as Steamboat ended up chopping him and running him to the back with a chair. Unbelievable. Yeah, I think they're mad at Ricky Steamboat, but I think Dalton and Andrews are gonna pay for it. Well, the Carnage crew are just getting everybody upset with them tonight. Make no mistake, the Carnage crew is more than bad attitudes. This is a talented team that has been performing at a very high level in the recent months. The Moff and Whitmer feud has escalated and it's really put them over the edge. Oh! Vicious, vicious cross faces. How? It's way too early to just say who's going to win the end of that feud between the Carnage crew and Whiff and Moff and, Ma Ma and Whitmer that whoever wins that feud has to be considered the leading contenders for the ROH Tag Team Championship. No doubt. And I got a feeling that the losers and probably the winners of that feud are gonna come out of it with a couple of years taken off their career. And we saw that blood loss last night in Dayton. Well, that was brutal last night. And that was the match that impressed Mick Foley to the point that Foley wanted to make him his pro take Moff and Whitmer under the rings, especially the double concerto into the metal garbage can on the Carnage crew. Who will ever forget Scramble Cage Mealy with the Carnage crew going at it with Moff and Whitmer. Glory by Honor 3 when Moff and Whitmer tried to take out the Beatles knees. And of course, Midnight Express reunion. Cloak and the Beatle taking advantage that Whitmer was there alone that night and giving him the baseball bats on the garbage can. And here comes Andrews. Wow, Andrews showing a lot of fight. Coming out of the ROH Wrestling School, the very first class just graduated, and Andrews looks like he learned his lessons well. Well, I hope he did, because this is a lot stiffer test than anything he anticipated. Especially under these circumstances, he came here tonight thinking he was gonna wrestle TJ Dalton in a tryout match. Uh-oh. Loke and DeVito, so polished as a combination. Carnage Plex. That should be it for Andrews. Can't expect much out of a kid in just a second match when he's in there with veterans like Logan DeVito. And it looks like TJ Dalton from right here in the Midwest area. He's about to be the recipient of that Splash Mountain neckbreaker combination. We all knew it was coming. That's gonna be it for Dalton. Well, I do have a lot of respect for both Dalton and Andrews. They came into this match and took the fight right to Carnage Crew. I, for that, you have to respect. I have a lot of respect for them even demanding this match after what happened to them in the opening of the show. Very gutsy effort from these upcomers. And we know what's coming up now. Davey Andrews' career could be over before it started after this Carnage Plex. 